Hi guys, so starting off, I'm going to be using the Maybelline Instant Age Rewind Concealer. Since I am skipping foundation totally, I'm just going to put this under my eyes to cancel out any under eye circles and to lighten up my face a little bit. And now I'm just going to take my fingers and blend it underneath my eyes just so it's all blended and not cakey looking. And now I'm taking the Maybelline Fit Me Concealer in light and I'm putting it on any blemishes that I have since I am skipping foundation totally. I just want to make sure that no blemishes are out. And now I'm going to take my beauty blender and just blend away until the concealer is fully blended and not cakey looking. And now I'm going to be taking the Rimmel Stay Matte Powder in Transparent and I'm just going to be taking an Equal Tools powder brush and just putting that all over my face to mattify it. And now I'm going to be taking the Benefit Hula Bronzer and a Sephora contour brush and I'm just going to be contouring all over my face, especially my cheekbones. And now I'm going to take the Maybelline Fast Precise Highlighting Blush in Light Bronze and put that on my cheek. And now I'm gonna be taking the Anastasia Brow Wiz and Ash Blonde. I'm just filling in sparse hairs. If you wanna see an everyday brow routine, let me know down below. And now I'm going to be taking my Urban Decay Naked Basics Palette and I'm just gonna be filling, my, filling in my brows with these shadows Naked 2 and Faint. And now I'm taking a Rimmel Scandalized Shadow Stick and I'm just going to prime my eyes for eyeshadow. And now I'm taking the Urban Decay Naked One Palette and I'm just going to be taking the shades Virgin and Sin all over my lids. And now I'm taking a matte crease brush and the shade Naked and putting a bunch of that into my crease just to define my eyes. And now I'm taking the shade Smog from the Naked palette and just adding that into my crease for more depth. So now I'm taking the Maybelline Great Lash Mascara. I use this for length on my lashes. It really makes my lashes look super long and dramatic. And now I'm taking the L'Oreal Lash Out Butterfly to add a ton of volume to my lashes. First for my lips, I'm taking the Blissex Chapstick. And lastly, I'm taking the L'Oreal Lip Gloss in Stubborn Plum. And now time to fix that cray cray hair girl. I don't know about you, but when I wake up and I'm feeling lazy, I just put my hair up. My ring is from a local antique store, and my flannel is from Goodwill. 
and my shorts are from PacSun. My crossbody bag is from Steve Madden and it has gold hardware and it's black. My shirt is a plain white v-neck from Target and my necklace is from Forever 21. And that's the final look for when I'm running late.